Hey everyone, Aaron here from Triforce of Chaos, and this is Talking Points. Okay, TOC fans, as you saw last week, we weren't able to do a post, well, we weren't able to post a Talking Points video due to technical difficulties. Well, being the tech guy I am, Today I've fixed those technical difficulties, well I've fixed those technical difficulties so I can bring you a new video today. We addressed everything in, from last week's video that I was going to do in the uh, podcast, which ran it over a little extra, but that's okay. You know, I'm sure you fans enjoy watching 50 minutes of me and Josh blabber and talk like that, but hey. We're having a good time. Hopefully you're having a good time watching us. So, uh, as you can see here... I know I promised in a couple of videos back that Will was going to start joining me for some of the uh, talking points. Well, unfortunately, due to technical issues of his own, you know, it seems like the technical issue fairy seems to be hitting all of us. Hopefully it doesn't hit Josh. You know, he's, he's the one with all the good equipment. Um, Will, wouldn't, Will would not be able to join me this week. Hopefully we can get him uh, in our next video next week. And uh, hopefully we can get some of his game footage either next week or the week after. Um, we're going to have to wait and see. I know he's been. I know he was hoping to do something with the Dragon Age game that he has. I think it's Dragon Age Inquisition, but due to some technical difficulties with some of his equipment, he hasn't been able to play that game anymore. So hopefully he can get that fixed. Um, another thing you. Another thing I want to talk about is, as you all know. I tend to be a huge fan of collectibles. I've got a couple of things here I want to show off today, plus a new video game that, well, it's not so new, but it's new to us at TOC and in my house. So, I'll start off with the collectibles. First thing I've got here, everyone knows I'm a huge Alien and Predator nerd, so I went ahead and bought the, some Funko Pops for, from the past couple of weeks. First one I got was the alien here. It's super, it's one of those, it feels like it's a little super deformed kind of deal. It has a moving head. That's about all that moves on it. I like it. I mean, it's, I, I love these things. I've, I think I've gotten into a bad habit here of collecting. So these are going, I'm going to have to have a shelf pretty soon filled with these things. The other one I've got here is the Predator. Found this about last week, week before. And I was going to show this off on the, uh, on uh, last week's talking points, but never did get a chance, so now I'm showing them off. Finally, I do have one more thing here I want to show off that's I mean, it's a collectible, but it's also a game piece from from Nintendo. I, I don't have the Wii U yet. I happen to walk around, and I'm a big Legends of Zelda fan, of course, another thing everybody should know from watching our videos. So... I ended up getting the Legends of Zelda Link Amiibo. There's, I think they have the Link at like that, and then they have the Toon Link. So I was happy to find that. That was, that was all. That's always fun to find stuff like that. So that's about all for my collectibles. Now to go on to that video game I was telling you about, which is Disney Infinity. Of course, you see I'm a PS3 player. That's something me and my wife always tend to have fun with is anything video games that, you know, anything that we can do together that's easy. And Disney Infinity seems like it would be easy because it's, Disney's always geared towards everybody. So it, they, they try to make things easy and fun. I mean, Disney Universe, it's fun, but camera angles and all that just don't make it easy. This, on the other hand, I, I've done a, you know I've done a little demoing with it. Seems like it's going to run pretty well. You know, maybe maybe in the future I can get some let's plays going with that. Until then, I'll I'll continue doing my let's plays with uh, the games we're playing now, which is pretty much. I think right now I'm working on Saints Row the Third, which is really 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 one of my favorite games to play because it's just it, the funny factor in it. So, you know, after we got that, it came with Merida, which 
Everybody knows the movie. Everybody that's seen the movie Brave knows who Merida is. And it also came with Stitch. You know, Lilo and Stitch. This little bastard's funny as hell. I I, I love watching uh, him destroy stuff. Of course, I have to get my favorite. Di my wife had to pick up my favorite Disney character for me, Donald Duck. I've always been a huge Donald Duck fan. Just because, you know, he flies off the handle and I fly off the handle whenever I have technical issues. You know, that's behind the scenes stuff y'all don't get to see. I try to behave myself. So, and she got herself Sorcerer Mickey. She is a huge Disney fan and this is one of her favorite things to have is Sorcerer Mickey's. She actually had one in the back of her old car. I think she still has it. It's uh, pretty well deformed from the uh, heat. So it he he doesn't like Mickey anymore. He kind of he kind of looks a little odd, but that's a uh, that's something we were happy to get get involved with. Also, another thing you know, I told you I'm I'm a tech guy. I tend to be a big fan of t little gadgets and stuff like that. Well, I happened to pick this up a while back. I've been meaning to show this off, but anybody that's seen Star Wars knows who Boba Fett is, and knows that and you know watching TOC videos y'all hear me talk about Mandalorians, Boba Fett, all that fun stuff. Well, he's Boba Fett and he's a thumb drive. So as you can see, helmet goes on, looks like a regular little toy, helmet comes off. TOC videos can be uploaded to our uh, our uploaded to our computers for editing and all that. So that's that's all my collectibles and stuff that I have. So now we're going to the we're going to the next thing I wanted to talk about, which is Skyrim. Everybody knows how awesome of a game that was, or how annoying of a game that was, depending on you know if you're pro or anti Skyrim. If you've played it, I was a huge Skyrim fan. I mean, literally played that game for days on end, hours on end. I finally, as of yesterday, beat the uh, beat the story of it. I, I just I played all three DLC packs. You know, Hearth Hearthfire really isn't so much of a playable pack as it is just a stuff pack. Um, Dawn Guard was all about the vampires. I beat that earlier earlier this year, and that was that was a fun storyline. But beating Dragonborn. That storyline in its own made that it made the game feel complete. You go from you know fighting dragons to fighting a dra another dragonborn, the first dragonborn, Mirok. Again, play the game if you if you haven't, you'll enjoy it. I think the legendary editions out now. Go out there, try it out, have a great time. You'll you'll get you'll get immersed in this game. And now on to the talking point question of the week, which is. Which collectible games, you know, like Skylanders, Disney Infinity, or any of those games kind of like that, do you really enjoy playing? I know I've gotten big and I've never played Skylanders. My, my niece is big about Skylanders. Every time she gets a chance, it's always Skylander this, Skylander that. Well, now she's getting into the whole amiibo collection which is pretty neat I mean adding that factor to the game makes it awesome you know it really takes you see everybody's working now to try to get this toy to video game standard going so I, I you know I figured that's pretty awesome now find you know I just want to know which game y'all find interesting you you can uh leave us a comment below or well I'll, I'll post I think I'll end up posting these questions on my Twitter page and I'll have uh, Josh work on getting it on the main Twitter page as well so we can get everybody answering these questions so we can read them all from three different mediums and uh, also you know I'll we'll uh, put it on the Facebook page as well you know that way we can have everybody answering this qu like I said everybody can answer this question on multiple mediums um Anyway, that's about all the time I have for today. You can uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe below. You can follow us on uh, Twitter and Facebook. Links will be in the description. 
And you can check out our awesome new merch shop, which the link will also be in the description. We've got some awesome shirts in there. You know, there's one of them in there that, that I helped design. Make sure you check that out. It's, you know, it's it's something that goes along with one of our Minecraft games. One of with the TOC plays Minecraft. I think everybody will really enjoy, you know, spending their money on TOC, you know. Again, sorry, bad humor and stammering. I've been up most of the day. I'm tired. You know, I know. Now I'm starting to whine. Sorry, sorry. You know, we'll, we'll we ain't gonna worry about that too much. Anyway, that's about all I want to say about all that stuff. So we'll see you next go around, guys. Thank you for watching. I'm Aaron with Triforce of Chaos, and uh, have a good day.